Oh, um, okay. I would say the first thing you need to do is, uh, if you think it's an entity, is to take the spiritual bath. Yeah. Uh-huh. At first, you know, that's, uh, what is it, uh, um, three caps of bleach, three caps of ammonia. Okay. Three uh-huh. caps, you heard of that one, right? Uh, three yeah, caps yeah. of lemon juice. And then, and I think what three caps of apple cider vinegar, okay, and then a half a cup of sea salt in a bathtub full of water, and get up in there and take that bath, and then okay. get up and put your whole head under the water, and then get up and shower off, and so that'll pretty much take care of the entity thing. But if you still had an activity before that, after that, then it might have been a spiritual experience that you thought was uh, an abduction or an invasion and stuff. It might be your own. Uh, stuff that's happening because the conscious people are going to go through some things. Uh-huh. <laughs> a lot of times they're going to be thinking it's outwardly, but it will be inwardly. So yeah. you need okay. to find out about that part. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. I get it. I get yeah. it. Yeah. All so right. It's part of your own acceleration. The, uh, okay. it's, it's like Blue just said, she asked what's going to be going on. Well, you just expect a mass acceleration in the spirit mm-hmm. stuff. So yeah. stuff that would have taken... Somebody 20 years ago, 20 years to do, it's going to take you 20 years later, 20 seconds to do, because we into an, a mass acceleration. Okay. And time is, you know, um, and, and that's what, that's t- time is, it's going to be rapid stuff that's happening, you see. Uh-huh. And, and, uh-huh. and look for stuff like that. All right. Yep. Yep. Okay. All right. That'll work. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Peace to you. All right, we're going to go to the next caller. Calling in, it looks like, from area code 215. You're live in the remix. Please tell us who you are and where you're calling from. Yeah, it's not going to be that long. You, Peace. You Hello? Me, yeah, how you doing? You clicked me on early. I had another question. Is it all right? <laughs> yes, go ahead. I didn't. I, yes, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> all right, Bobby. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. What do you think about the, uh, the nation of gods and earth and Clarence 13 next calling himself God? Well, mm-hmm. they were owned to something, because ultimately that's what we are. John chapter 10, verse 34, 36. Ye are gods. You see what I'm saying? Uh, you know, so that concept, it, I, mean, it was, it, it was, it, I mean, it was an early concept, but at least now that we are finding that's what we are, it's not so alien for some people because he did bring that <clears throat> to the table. You see what I'm saying? So some things can come early. Because Elijah Muhammad said we were God. So some things come early. So, um, so what happens is, is um, when we are faced to deal with that now, uh, we would have been introduced to it before. So he was right on the money with that type stuff, you see, on, on that particular thing, you know, um, on, that, on that level and stuff. Now, as far as the earth of gods and men, uh, 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 gods and, uh, and earth and all that now, as far as some of the people, as far as the organization, you see what I'm saying and all, you know, that's a whole other thing. You see, that's a whole other thing. I don't think you're going to get no spiritual edification, you know, uh, um, hanging around that ragtag group. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Um, on that particular level, you're supposed to take those teachings and then take those teachings and go to the next level and stuff like that. But as far as being a doggone card carrying member to any of them groups and shit is going to retard your process. You see what I'm saying? On that particular level. You know, right. so. You mean like yeah, take, so what, was, take what you can learn from it and, and grow. Take what to the you next. can learn from it and stuff and the experiences and stuff like that. But um, but it, but as far as being in any of those groups and stuff like that is not the not the move. Now you can't spiritually grow and turn into the God and nurture yourself into the God hanging around a bunch of goddamn dingbats and shit. You know, <laughs> uh, you know and stuff. You know, um, uh, niggas is getting all kind of lessons and all kind of stuff wrong. You know, I heard a, a more one time say, we came over here on trains. How the fuck you going to have some trains across the damn Atlantic Ocean? You see? So wow. I'm just trying to just say, you know, that's the thing about groups and stuff. It's, it's, it's as bad as the weakest link. So, you know, but you learn from the, the history of it and, 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 the, and the philosophy of it, but I wouldn't suggest staying around them niggas. Okay. You know. Did you, did you happen to see the movie X-Men, the new X-Men movie? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What do you think? Um, is that, um, that's us? Well, yeah, well, you know, any of that X-Men stuff is us. I did right. notice that they, you know, they, they always going to kill the brother, but that's the killing the old side. Yeah. But they did have the little black girl as the fairy. 
Right, so they the sure did. Time, you know, this black girl is introduced as a fairy. She had the fairy wings. Yeah, so, yeah. She the... <clears throat> and she's decent. actually yeah. she's actually Lisa Bonet and um, what's his name? Um, um, Lenny Kravitz. Lenny Kravitz. Lenny Kravitz. Oh, daughter. So she's a legacy thing. Okay. Yeah. That's Lisa yeah. Bonet's daughter, and Lenny Kravitz. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. that's who that was. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. So that's, Thank you. Yeah. Thank okay. You. Calling in, brother. Yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. She was the fairy in the in the yeah. in the Matrix in um, mm-hmm. in the X Men, and that was her mm-hmm. power. That was a big part of her power, yeah. the fairy power. Yes. Exactly. Yep. And the brother who came to save him, I save her. Of course, he had to die. You know. Right. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna right. go to the next caller calling in. It looks like from area code three four seven. You're live in the remix. Please tell us who you are and where you're calling from. Peace, Miss Blue. Peace, Brother Bobby. I'm in this last yeah. phone out of VA. And uh, I want to thank y'all. I learned so much from uh, listening to y'all. And uh, my question was about the Demiurge. Um, mm-hmm. I've been studying a lot, and uh, I've been mm-hmm. going a lot. But all my life, I've seen, like, like it's just, like, this this energy against me, like, trying to hold me down. Like, I always used to think, like, God hates me or something like that. You know, so mm-hmm. I want I wanted to ask about that concept, kind of. You could kind of clear it up for me if you could. Well, well it uh, as far as the spirit world goes, as far as this uh, opposing forces, that's right. already ascended now. They, there's no more demiurge, no more none of that. Mm-hmm. They have all ascended now. Even the demons and stuff done turned into light. Everything mm-hmm. up there. Only thing is left is us. You see mm-hmm. what I'm saying? The only thing left is us. And if if you get anything now. As far as you creating it out of your own mind, as far as anything happening to you that's negative or whatever, you mm. see, and all, yeah, because mm. all that's gone now. That stuff is um, uh, between the millennium, the millennium, um, 2001, when them buildings fell, and right. for the rest of the millennium, it, all those particular gods and all the stuff in heaven and rose up. They're all together now. Mm. It's, we're the last frontier right here. So anything happening now with you, you creating it yourself because you might be in a pattern of being mm. used to something all your life. Right. You see what I'm saying? It might be a habit. So mm. right now you have the power, but there ain't nothing standing over you, you know, right. Um, right. Uh, um, trying to hold you down. They got too many important things, you see what I'm saying, to try to hold you down and stuff. You see what okay, I'm saying? okay. So basically it's like, it's like my own ego, like, like, yeah, it's, it's, it all, everything that's happening now, you bring on yourself. Mm. And so that's how you got to change your thoughts. Mm. You know, you, you got you to cha- change your thoughts and stuff, you know, on that uh, particular level. Okay. Right. So, uh, but, and, and, and get rid of your fears, because there ain't no groups out there, no group of guards, or no demiers, anybody out here. Right, right, right. All right. Uh, um, all right. Uh, yeah, and um, right. There ain't no group guard. Now, that magic mirror pulls out. That's another thing. It pulls out negative energy. Mm-hmm. So whenever you get a chance, you know, you get that magic mirror because you can redo stuff. And with the womb CD, you can redo your whole self because you're going back into the womb. So, like I said, that new package, man, um, uh, that new yeah. package, you see. And I, and I, uh, only, do, I only do shit uh, when the spirit give it to me. You see mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I, so I don't make up nothing and try to make some some new gimmick to get some money, and then halfway oh, down no. the road, the shit fills out. Oh, no, 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 no. So, so no, the spirits brought this one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it's also, so that's one thing you might look into, because that also uh, pulls negative energy out, or it uh, 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 pulls negative perception. Okay. You put, put it that way, uh, yeah. Uh, so, so then yeah, it's okay. just the perception. It's just the perception yeah. how I'm looking at it. Yeah, how you look oh, at yeah. things. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, thank you for uh, calling uh, in. Uh, thank Peace. you for that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. All right. We're going to go to the next caller calling, and it looks like from area code 704. You're live in the remix. Please tell us who you are and where you're calling from. Peace. My name is uh, Wiley from North Carolina. Okay. Mm-hmm. Greetings to you. How you doing? I just had um, one quick question for Brother Bobby. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to know, um, did you have you heard anything about um, go-to cola being um, a good thing to um, help decalcify the pineal gland? Go to cola. I know it does a lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, um, I, you know, but I, I, um, well, let's put it this way. Uh, 
I wouldn't worry about calcification because if you're conscious, your, your pineal gland is working. Otherwise, you wouldn't be conscious. Yeah. yeah. You see what I'm saying? So I, I wouldn't really worry about that and stuff. I mean, you know, um, uh, that's one thing about it and stuff. You know, if you wasn't conscious and stuff, you you, you know, that, that would be a concern or whatever type thing. But, you know, um, but but got to realize now all this stuff is getting ready to happen. Uh, the sun itself is going to emit so many cosmic rays and raise the... the uh, yeah. Uh, melatonin level of that's what these sunspots are. Right. Yeah, they've already been saying and, that it's uh, emitting some kind of strange particle. Yeah, so, solar flares and stuff like that. Yep. Now Linda got burnt on her face with a solar flare in the middle of fucking February in the cold. Mm. That's how powerful a solar solar flare. So she had a damn suntan in the in the middle of fucking February in, uh, in wow. the cold. And that, but that sunspot, did she matter have been on damn Mars? Mm. <laughs> uh, solar wow. flare. Yeah. Those solar yeah. flares, and that's happening now, so that's going to be raising the people. Okay. You see, yeah, up to. Okay, appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, all okay. Right. That's all I have for y'all. All right, well, yeah. peace. 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 All peace. right, peace. Brother Bobby, I think we're going to go ahead and close out. I'm going to let you have the last words kind of take us out of here. I'll, for everyone, it's been an amazing share. Thank you. It's always great to have you come on, share your information, your knowledge, your wisdom, and everything with us. So... I'm yes. going to turn it over to you to, to close us out. Well, like I said, um, um, it's, it's pineal awakening time, and it's happening. And a lot of the events, a lot of things that people have been come, calling in to comment on certain things happen to them is a part of the pineal awakening. So that's happening. So, uh, um, uh, And like I said, not trying to uh, uh, toot my own horn, but my point here is that when the spirits give me something, you see, yeah. that means that that's what time it is, and right now that's what time it is. So, uh, uh, you know, obtain this magic mirror with with, the, with those Egyptian motifs on it, and all uh, you know. And like I said, if you if you get an idea that you want to um, laminate them, you can do that. You don't have to, but um, lamination is always always good too because you can get a shine on it, so it would literally be a mirror. But the way it is now, you don't have to do anything, but just because you, you're basically interested in staying into the black hole and, and focusing on your third eye. So uh, uh, that's, that, that's how you do that. Um, so, yeah, so uh, like I said, so, um, you know, 678-358-1055, and um, it's been great, you know. Yeah. And I won't stay away too long. Uh, yes. But you know, I had to go through my ordeal and stuff, and I damn near disappeared the last time, so. As the radar says, out at the airport, but, yeah. That's it. Well, Brother Bobby, it's always amazing. Like I said, peace to you and your queen. I know we'll be in touch. You'll be coming back on the show. Everyone, make sure you download, download, download the show. It is definitely one. If you want to get in contact with Brother Bobby Hemet, 678-358-1055 is the number to call. We're going to listen to a little bit of power and take us out of here this evening. Peace and love to you, Brother Bobby, and thank you so All much right. for joining us. All right, okay. peace. We'll talk. Okay. All right.